not me, I don't need to be fun. I know who I wouldn't. Who? <laughs> Charlie or oh, Charlie? Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, no, it's huge. I reckon Pitto. Yeah. Brad Pitt, uh, yeah, 100% Pitto, big Pitto. Switched on and then you'd be on his phone, I reckon. Go for a walk with him. <laughs> yeah, he'd be doing something. He'd walk around with his airpods. <laughs> I don't want to say what I was going to I was going to say stock, but he'll be wrapped that I said that. Liam Stocker. Sauce is pretty good, actually. Yeah. See, I would, I would go fish because all I'd need to say is I'm on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire and he'd be loudspeaker Google giving straight me the away. answer straight away. So. I'll probably say Sam Doherty, pretty knowledgeable. Obi would, if he called Obi, he would give you the answer, but he would be minutes. that confident and it would be wrong. Yeah, but it would take 10 minutes to get it out of him as well. Waiters. Yeah, he'd be up there. Austin McDonald is sneakily smart. Mm. He knows a lot of stuff. Setters, Will Setterfield. I reckon underratedly smart, Lewis Young. I reckon he would be good at a show like that. Not him. Not me. <laughs> Not the, can't cook, can't do anything, so. <laughs> um, probably stay with, I don't know, Weed is probably be a good one. Um, I reckon he's just very muscular and strong and um, he'll protect you, so. The zombie apocalypse for sure. Weed yeah. is stand behind him, but the zombies get him, <laughs> so you can run away. Stick um, together or? Yeah. It's a bit of K. <laughs> Definitely yeah. not Parksy. Not Parksy, it's horror. He's known as Mazzy because he has a lot of nightmares. <laughs> I'll go somewhere like a, a cot. Uh, so yeah. He's got, he's got a wet or camping no, gear. No, I'm with food. He's Ma got a dog like wig, so yeah. scare away. Matthew Kennedy, just with his camping gear. We survived camp. Me and you. Just. <laughs> we still survive. <laughs> um, we're in the wilderness. I'll tell you Matt Kennedy. He's, when we were camping, he had a pretty nice setup. Yeah. He looked like he knew what he was doing. He had all so, the gear. Zombie Apocalypse, I'd almost take Pitto, just because I know Pitto would stand there and cop it from the zombies <laughs> and then get away. <laughs> That was like and it, yeah, yeah. And it'd just take him a while anyway. I'd probably say Pitto, because I know I'm quicker than him. He'd probably get caught first. Imagine if he doesn't get caught though, oh, and then oh, you've got to spend a zombie apocalypse with <laughs> That's the worst result ever. No, Pitto entertains me enough. Oh my god. I'd feed, I'd, I'd give myself <laughs> to the zombies if I had to be with Pitto for that long. Who's crafty? I feel like Cuts. Cots or Honey or oh, yeah. one of them would be pretty good. Yeah. But you wouldn't get much chat out of Honey, so probably no. Cots. Yeah. Probably, I reckon, I reckon um, Kennedy, yeah. Matthew Kennedy, because he's got the whole ute set up and he's got just all the gadgets on his ute and we had to go out to the wilderness. And he wouldn't take anything seriously. No, yeah, yeah seriously. Just, just yeah. Probably, yeah, probably Kennedy. But I'm yes. probably up there, I know a lot of people with my stuff. No, I just like to annoy people when I'm bored. Fair yeah, enough. probably just anything stocks doing to you. That's a bit odd. Matt always, when he moves his mouth and talks. <laughs> Boydy with his fingernails, <laughs> half painted. Oh, yeah. Paints them halfway. Is that annoying? <laughs> <laughs> it's annoying? It's not even a habit. But it's not a habit, but it's annoying. Oh, this is really annoying. <laughs> Stocker's locker is like rusted open, I think, because it's never shut. And I'm, I'm, I'm right next to him, so um, yeah, I've never seen it shut. I think there's something wrong with the hinges or something. <laughs> My locker's next to a. Uh, um, Matt Kennedy, so oh. yeah, there's a few speedos that are not mine sort of in my locker. He, he thinks he uh, owns two lockers at the moment, so probably him, I'd say. <laughs> he probably just thinks he owns my locker as well. Dirds, so he, he'll eat a meal and then he'll go to the, the sink and actually wash everything off his plate, but then he'll still chuck it in the dishwasher, so it's just extra work. Um, <laughs> That's how you meant to do it, mate. <laughs> you may as well just finish washing the plate. Oh, yeah, I know, I suppose. <laughs> Look, we can throw each other under the bus. We can keep going. <laughs> I'd probably say Nick Newman. He seems yeah, to always Nick, be getting yeah, around definitely. the boys, injured, non-injured. Yeah, he always looks, up, looks after the boys on the night out, too. <laughs> Hey, he's good looking. Yeah. Uh, I noticed in my experience, Doc, just because he'd gone through similar injuries, was very caring uh, and similar to Nui as well. Um, they were, yeah, certainly put the uh, put everyone before you and always had time to check in. Yeah, I'd say Nui as well. He, um, when I was injured last year, he took me out for um, brekkie just to kind of chat through it and probably Walsh as well. I reckon he's always good for it. Messages check in, so uh, probably those two. Probably you actually. Thanks. I'll give you that. Thanks. He's got it a few times actually. Yeah, yeah. Really?
I'd give Newey. Uh, Harry's pretty good with that stuff. Good to Oh, he's just pretty good as well. Sam Doherty. He's been uh, there. He's been oh, through it. Yeah, Doc. Luke Powers, like, you take away. Luke Powers, one that always checks in. I'd say the big man here himself, or maybe Ed Kerner as well. Ed's pretty good at getting around and yeah. um, understand what's going on with people. Yeah, I'll say the Kerner. He, he can't cool. Facts. Mom, yeah, I'm terrible. I wouldn't back Dowie into... I'll say, I'll say Kempy, man. Yeah, Kempy. Kempy doesn't know how to clean. I probably would say me that I'm pretty bad in the kitchen. Oh, definitely Matt Cottrell. Oh, some horrors in the kitchen, that's for sure. Yeah, Matt Cottrell, I've been camping a few times with Cots and can't cook a meal to save himself. Parksy. I've had a few <laughs> butchered meals at home. A Parksy. Parksy preheated the house one night. <laughs> <laughs> Left the stove on overnight. <laughs> I've had but butter chicken that was cooked for eight hours I think, <laughs> on a high heat. <laughs> Charcoal butter chicken was good. He has a bad habit of going to the shops and forgetting half the ingredients <laughs> and then going back and then starting again. <laughs> yeah, I, was, I don't know, if they were together then they'd definitely mention me, but nah, if I was with King he'd say Cottrell as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'd be up there. <laughs> Dirts was probably the... Um, I don't know, he hasn't shown too much cooking skills, but I'm sure if he got a bit of practice, he'd be a drop. Let's just say I don't cook chicken too well. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'd, I'd agree with that. Yeah, that's not okay. Well, myself and Walshie once tried to cook for Luke Power and sort of like smoked out the whole kitchen. It was a bit of a... It was a bit See, of a I'm the main chef and when I'm not there, that happens. Yeah.